Hello, YouTube land, and welcome to another edition of the Crypto Mamma Mia. Today is May 11th, 2021. What am I talking about today on this thankful Tuesday? Well, ladies and gents, I just have to say I am thankful that I am not only in the stock market, that I am into the crypto market, and I will give you my exact reasons why. But before I do that, let me remind you, I am not your financial advisor. This is not financial advice. Go read my disclaimer and always watch the latest and the greatest. So why am I thankful? Ladies and gents, look at this. Dow down more than 500 points as tech-led sell-off spills over to broader markets. So when the tech stocks go down, you know, like Google and Apple and Amazon and Facebook, it brings everything down, right? Everything, even things that are not associated with tech, things like L Brands has nothing to do with tech. In fact, they own uh, Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works and they are down 3.29%, right? And don't get me wrong, ladies and gents, I still do have stocks, but I'm always, I don't have mutual funds anymore because I don't trust them, right? They pick it for you. I rather pick my own individual stocks so that I can watch it, monitor it, do things like core compound it, you know, build up my, my portfolio on my own instead of just waiting for a mutual fund to maybe give me like 3% a year, 5%, 7%, whatever the case may be right? I mean, no, <laughs> I'm not going to do that. So, and then look at this, ladies and gents. This is the reason why I'm so thankful. Another reason why. Look at this Bitcoin market. I mean, from all time to now, it's just, it's just crazy. It's just, I, it's just ridiculous to me, right? And even though it went down, because it went down just like the Dow, but it didn't go down too much. And I don't think it'll ever go down too much ever again. You know, that's just my opinion though. Now, if we look at, I, I look at this, see, everything is down, S&P, Dow, NASDAQ, but look at this, ladies and gents, what? <laughs> it's up, it's actually up 520%, even though, even though it's pretty much a red day. In fact, let's go back, let's pull out here. That's great. By the way, if you're in a tent, if you're in any kind of bond, really, people, <laughs> again, I'm not telling you what to do with your money, but why? Why would you subject yourself to this? And it's, you know, I won't even get any further into it. Even though a lot of things are down, I mean, up slightly. But even with that being said, the whole coin market cap crypto is still up. Still up, ladies and gents. That is why I'm thankful for the crypto market. I mean, it's crazy. In fact, we can do a side-by-side -side analysis of one of the better. Let's, let's go Google right let's look at let's compare google and bitcoin right okay so let's see google is down right now Whew. google is down let's go to the max okay so let's say in 2004 as you can see here hold on let's try to full screen it all right so i got a full screen here for the google stock now let's look at the price back on, let's just go, uh, let's say, let's say 2017, because that's when Bitcoin was really picking up traction, right? Like maybe, maybe towards the end, right? So let's say around here, September, December. So in December, uh, let's go summer even, summer of 2017, uh, so then back then, it was about 900 to a th maybe 1,000 at the most, right? So 950, let's just average it out. Now let's look at 2017 Bitcoin. Um, let's see. So let's say August the price was about 4,000, right? So 4,000, uh, even June, or oh, like even lower, like 
let's just average it out to 3,000, right? To summer of 2017 to, let's just say 3,000. And for uh, Google, summer of 2017, let's just say 900, right? 950. So back then, 950 and today, you know, close to 2,300, right? So 950, uh, that's about a, that's almost a, a two and a half X, almost three X, right? Now let's look at Bitcoin. <laughs> like we said 3000, right? Around the same time frame to now 56,000. So who that's way, that is like a 15 X right there, ladies and gents, right? approximately maybe a little bit more i'm not really good at spot math but hey i <laughs> i know that this person like multiplied your google stock only multiplied about 3x right but your bitcoin multiplied 15x in the, in the same time frame, ladies and gents. Now, if you can find me any other stock that has 15X in the same time frame, please let me know because like I said, I still do hold stocks and I would love to know. I would love to know because I haven't found any and I'm always watching. I'm always watching. I'm always listening. I'm always, always, always looking out for news, things like this. And that is how you grow your portfolio, ladies and gents. But that's what I'm thankful that I'm not only in the stock market, but I'm in the crypto market. Like I said, in fact, I think I'm leaning more heavily towards being just majority in the crypto market. But I will always still have some stocks. I mean, I do have Google stock, don't get me wrong. But my goodness, ladies and gents, how, how can these two compare? Right. And this is the one of the more higher gain stocks. Right. I mean, not a whole lot of maybe Amazon, but not a whole lot of other stocks have gained as much as these in the past in that time frame anyways, in the same time frame as Bitcoin. And that's just Bitcoin, ladies and gents. Don't even get me started on things like Ethereum. <laughs> which by the way is still over 4,000 or Binance coin or even silly little Dogecoin, right? Don't get me started on things like that. Dogecoin, oh my goodness. It's a freaking joke, but like, you know what? I, I won't even get into that. That's a different video for a different day. But yeah, ladies and gents, this is why I am so thankful for the crypto market, right? Well, I hope you enjoyed that little lesson for today. Hope that you all are staying safe, staying healthy, staying sane. Most important of all, have a great day or night wherever you are. And I will see you at the next video. Adios.